How's it going guys? This is Robert and today I have a Paul Gilbert style look for you. What? So um, Paul Gilbert's a humongous influence of mine. I actually have ne never done a video in his style and as often as I um, rip off his guitar licks and everything and put them in my videos. But yeah, this is just like a straight in the style of him and it's the way he does his three note per string. Um, at, like attempts, or not attempts, but the way he executes it I guess. And I do, uh, one thing different, if I can talk, is that the way he does it is he hammers on his first three notes, then he picks the next three. And what I do is I do the opposite, just because I've always preferred the sound of the, the pick attack first, and then the hammer-ons. So I'm just going to go ahead and play you the lick and everything, and then explain it, and throw some tabs up, and I hope you guys like it. So... <laughs> Here's a close-up of the lick. Um, it's all E minor. So what I'm doing here is, like I said, like you could do it either way. Uh, Paul Gilbert hammers on the first three notes and picks the next three. Um, I prefer the the other way. Just the okay. So either way is gonna work. It's still gonna sound like a Paul Gilbert kind of lick. So what I do is like. I pick the first three notes, so I'm just going to tell you the frets that I'm playing, and you're going to decide whether you pick the first three or hammer on the first three. So it goes 12, 14, 15 on the low E, and then on the A string, okay, then 14, 15, 17 on the low E and A. Okay, got a position shift. Now we're going to go 10, 12, 14 on the A, 10, 12, 14 on the D, okay, move up. We're going to go 12, 14, 15 on the A, 12, 14, 16 on the D, hop back to the A string, 14, 15, 17, and then on the D we're going to do 14, 16, 17, okay, then we've got 15, 17, 19 on the A, go down to the D, we're going to do 16, 17, 19. Okay, now we got another position shift. We're going to shift down, and then we're going to go do 12, 14, 16 again on the D. 12, 14, 16 on the G. Okay, then we're going to do, what is this, 14, 16, 17 on the D and the G. Okay, and then we got... Uh, what is this? 16, 17, 19 on the D and the G. Okay. And there's one little section here that's a little bit different from the other ones. And this is, it's coming right up right here. So then we have another shift down and we're going to do 12, 14, 16 on the G. And then you're going to do 13, 15, 17 on the B. Okay, and then you're actually going to pick the 13, 15, 17 again on the B, and then do your hammer-ons or, or picks, whatever, on 15, 17, I'm sorry, 14, 15, 17 on the high E. So those section went like this. I'm sorry. Okay, and we're on the home stretch now. And then we've got 15, 17, 19 on the B. 15, 17, 19 on the high E. Then we've got 17, 19, 20 on the B and high E. Okay, and then we got 19, 20, 22. Same thing on the high E. And then a bend. Do whatever you want. But yeah, that's pretty much the lick. Um, hopefully that wasn't too confusing when I was explaining it and everything, but I will have tabs up. So definitely check out the tabs. <laughs> so here's the lick played slow.
speed. <clears throat> Alright guys, that was the lick and everything. I hope that you liked it. Like I said, Paul Gilbert's a humongous influence of mine, as probably most of the people who watch my videos absolutely would have to love Paul Gilbert, because he's such a cool guy. Just it, what he teaches and just even talks. Like, I love listening to him even talk about his gear and everything. It's just fun. He makes everything fun. And like, as soon as I, you know, he, you know, watch a video of his or something, I instantly run off and grab my guitar and start playing. So, you know, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and everything. If you would, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can also uh, like me on Facebook. I do post some, like, exclusive videos only on Facebook with lessons and everything. And that's just www.facebook.com slash Robert Baker Guitar. Uh, first words capitalized, but I'll put that in the link and everything. And you can follow me on Twitter, too. I'll just throw that link in to the description as well, or the see more section, whatever it's called these days. So yeah, like I really hope that you guys liked that video and everything. There'll be lots more. I'm going to have an Eric Johnson style video coming up. I, just, I can't put a lick fast enough yet. So um, that'll probably be next week. So keep rocking, and I will see you guys later! <laughs>